Hello YouTube, we're still in lockdown, been loosened off a little bit but still not really getting out much are we most of us, uh, I haven't been out on my bike in, I don't know, six weeks, something like that, barely touched the car, uh, slowing the drone a little bit but not much, uh, and uh, so really not too many choices, but what I have been doing is lots of walking, which I do a lot anyway, uh, it's just something I've never really shared with you guys particularly, but uh, I think probably that's time to change. Um, what other options are there? Um, so today I'm walking up Malvern Hills. Here's a bit of a view. As you see, it's beautiful. It's a gorgeous day. Absolutely lovely day. Warm, not too warm. It's quite late in the day as well. It's nearly five o'clock. So it's cooling off a little bit. The idea is to do at least one of the peaks, possibly two see how things go. Anyway, hope you're all staying safe and I hope you like the video because it's obviously a bit of a departure to what I'm normally doing but uh, something I might start doing more of. So uh, anyway, hope you enjoy it. It's obviously very windy, here. There's a north hill behind me, which I've just been over the, the, the top of. Now heading down to go across. As you can tell, at this point there was so much wind noise you couldn't hear anything I was saying. Basically I was just describing the route I was going to take up towards the next peak, which is called the Beacon. I guess once I'm there, uh, I'll check. Uh, but I'm going to put this away because it's quite a steep little path and I don't want to end up uh, falling flat. So uh, I hope, it's, uh, hope you're enjoying it. And uh, I'll uh, we'll catch you again in a bit. So, more windy waffle about, uh, well, the north hill being behind me. I wasn't pointed to my nose. And that's the path I've just taken up there. And uh, heading up still towards the beacon, which is sort of up there. And actually further than that looks, uh, you, you can't actually see the peak from there. So that's just pointing out the route I was taking. Thank you. 
So, I'm at the top, obviously, well, now not quite at the very top. I've come down about 10 foot just to sit down for a few minutes and let other people get up to the top. You've got a, a top scope there, and uh, there's obviously the monument as well at the top, just pinpointing that this is the highest part of the Malvern Hills. And, well, it's beautiful up here. And this is the type of thing I hope that we as a nation start to appreciate a little bit more. Um, you know, I said I do quite a lot of walking, but I've got to say, even I'm appreciating it even more at the moment. And I hope lots of people do the same, really, because we've got a beautiful country and some amazing places to go and visit. Uh, obviously, it's been quite a departure for me, and it's, like I say, probably something I might start to do a bit more of, to be perfectly honest. So I hope you're enjoying it. Um, I'm all set for probably losing a bundle of the very few subscribers I've got anyway, but you never know, maybe I'll gain some as well. So I'm now just heading down from Summerhill, it's the last of the, the hills to sort of go pretty much to the peak of. I didn't quite go to the peak of it, I think I've done enough of that. Um, and uh, yeah, heading down a now very steep track. We get steeper there as well in just a minute. So uh, <laughs> this could be fun, but anyway, it's good. Uh, there's a bit of a lake down here, a bit of a pondy lake type thing which I'll go and try and find. If you're enjoying it, please give me a thumbs up and subscribe if you haven't already. If you're not liking it, well, tell me why if you really want it. You don't have to troll or whatever else. You can give it a thumbs down if you really want. I'm not going to cry over that. Uh, at least then I get, I'm getting some sort of level of feedback. But if you're going to give it a thumbs down, worth mentioning what you think's rubbish about it. And then at least I can look at trying to improve or ignore your thoughts, whichever I feel is the best thing to do. But I am open to criticism. Just uh, no need for trolls, that's all. Um, anyway, uh, I shall carry on and you'll see some more sights. So this is Ernslaw Lake, apparently, marked as a quarry. So I've scrambled down there, down there, and this is the actual quarry itself. Massive algae bloom. As you'd expect, I guess we've had so much sunshine, proper rock slides there as you can see, lots of sunshine and uh, warmth so the algae is really prevalent, don't think I want to go diving in that if I'm honest, but beautiful to get down here, totally away from everything and everybody, just the birds, as you can probably hear when I shut up. Yeah, this is uh, this is life. I mean, this is what life should be about. Now I've just got to scrabble back up there, so that could be fun. Wish me luck. 